You may ask, what happened with the cherries? Well, this is what happened. The birds started eating them, even with the netting. And so we had to pick them all a little prematurely, but they will go nicely in a cobbler or a crisp, and it'll be great. Um, we got to some of them before the birds did. Hi, and we're gonna make um, the batter of cherry cobbler, all just the three of us, no adults. She's only gonna help us with um, the cherries, right, Mom? Yep, that's right. I'm just going to pit the cherries for them. And these are um, our ingredients. Our the first one is our clever girl kids. baking powder. Right? And the next one butter. is butter. This one is. That one's probably flour. It's flour. And this one's What's sugar. This? this one's milk. So, and. Is there a measuring cup? This oh. one is one fourth a teaspoon. This oh. one is one teaspoon. Pour. And that's salt. This one is three fourths a cup. And this is the bowl we're gonna mix it in. This is the pan that the cherry cobbler is gonna go in. This bowl. Are you ready? You <laughs> And um, I just really want you to watch this whenever you before you're gonna have cherry cobbler like for one time um i really want you to watch this video okay now let's begin let's begin If you I'm don't have a cherry. I'm gonna figure it out. I'm gonna do it with you. Okay, so here's a cherry. No milk. Here's a chopstick. If you don't have a cherry pitter, um, this is the next best thing. I suggest wearing food service gloves of some sort or some kind of gloves, doubling them so your hands don't get all stained. But basically, where the stem is, that's where you're gonna insert the the bigger end of the chopstick, and you're just now going to push now right with, through. Now and there you go. Here is the hit. Okay? Really easy. And there's your cherry. What's the next step, Karina? Scatter the cherries. Scatter the cherries. Okay, 
these are fresh cherries from. Just sprinkle them all around our, our tree. tree. Yeah. For our tree, 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 tree. Mom, so how many cups is this? Sprinkle them around. Do you want to say how two, many cups it is? Two cups. Two cups of cherries. Mom, can you just like sprinkle cups. it around, please, so the cherries are all around the bed, yeah. so we can have. Yeah. Oh, ah! Whoop, we lost one. Good thing our table is so many cool. Good thing we're, good thing we're cooking. Okay, what's next, Green, after this? After this, we need to bake and fold Oh, the one batter. more thing, you forgot one thing. Oh yeah, the sugar. How much sugar? We need one tablespoon. Okay, and what do we do with it? Sprinkle it on the cherries. Sprinkle it on top. Yeah. So the cherries are nice and sweet. Mm -hmm. Now we need to so make eat. Them sweet. Actually, make a nice I need crust to eat. on top, too. Oh, yeah. Okay, and how long do we? 50 to 60 minutes. 50 to 60 minutes. And what degree oven? At 350. All right. We'll see you in 50 to 60 Bye. minutes. Bye. Out of the oven. Calissa. I thought you were going to make a top crust. But look, it made its own top crust. How did it do that? Uh, that's just how it went. Oh, careful. It's really, really hot. Ah, it so you know how we just put the cherries on top and the batter on bottom? Well, the batter rose up over the cherries. How does it do that? Magic. Hmm. There we have it. I wanted to watch it. Finished. Cherry. Come yeah, on. I want to have it.